Elliot's Mansion. Four, Gears of War Judgment. Three star, insane difficulty. And a classified challenge, which for this level is Locust Use One Shots. Uh, this is a interesting level. Um, you can't. So th this is a defense survival level. You have to protect the bot in this next area uh, from getting destroyed. <coughs> And uh, I guess the most important thing to note is that when you get out into the main area, uh, on the right hand side on the second floor, there's actually a hidden room that has a shitload of extra ammo and uh, some sentinels that you can set up at uh, convenient spots. Um, so be sure to get into there. There's kind of like a hidden switch. It's not too hard to find. Um, now that I'm telling you and you know to look for it, but it's, it's very helpful, especially the turrets. Um, so the locusts they use one shots they always go straight to the very back balcony very easy to take out if you I mean if you're staying along the what what I like to do at least for the first couple waves of this is set up the two Nasher sentinels right at the top of the stairs kind of towards that back balcony and then if you see the bot getting damaged run way back there and defend them, but for the most part, they're going to attack you instead of the bot. Um, but you do have to pay attention for when the bot's starting to get damaged. And then when you're uh, defending that back staircase, it's pretty easy to uh, to take out those one-shot dudes at will. So yeah, back here, I just set up the two Nashers like right at the top of the stairs. And I think I showed the door right away. Oh, I should have shown the door right away. That was dumb. Anyway, the hidden door is like right there. Okay, so yeah, there is a, a face or a statue on the wall with some eyeballs. And that was uh, right there. Uh, it's on the white wall right there. Why am I not doing it? Anyway. Yeah, it's right. It's on the on the right hand side right there. Uh, you just walk up to a hit X and it opens it up. And uh, all right, here you go. Uh, so yeah, just take out the one shots. Pretty easy to kill. Because they're dumb. No prisoners today. Anyway, uh, so it's pretty standard for this. Or this level is pretty standard. Um, uh, except the only potentially tricky thing is, and I don't know if they teach you this at all in this game, is in the very last wave, you're going to fight a couple of the... Uh, they're berserkers, I think they're called. Um, and you have to pick up a flamethrower and then light them on fire to do damage to them. So drop whatever non-lancer weapon you have Well, for the very last wave. And there'll be a couple of dudes with flamethrowers, so it's not like you have to really plan ahead. There will be flamethrowers for you to use. Oh, see, I'm looking for the switch now. God, I'm stupid. There it is. Boop, boop. Yeah, we got our own one shot, boom shots, another Nasher Sentinel, Onyx ammo caches, all that good shit. There we go. So yeah, just kind of surround this staircase right here. And the Nasher Sentinels will kind of defend each other, and then you can shoot down the stairs as well. Anyway, uh, yeah, pretty easy level.
Angulo. The bot's coming to us. The launch codes are in the mainframe. I thought the codes were in the other computer. Leave the tech to me, Private Ungrateful, and keep the grubs back! The bot's totally exposed!
shot. All for me. It's done here, and so are we. Let's roll. We had the launch codes, and we left. I was surprised. I kind of liked a few of the mansions I saw today. Maybe when this is all over, I'll take one for myself. Who's left to say no? Private Augustus Cole, you've been atypically quiet until now. Y'all, oh, listen up. All we gotta do is... Assume you actually listen to your crash ball coach from time to time? Crash ball? You're not a fan. Pretend war? No. How are you finding the real thing? I've been more comfortable. Then unburden your mind. 